We focus on prophecy every week for about five minutes. Approximately 25% of the Bible is prophetic. There are about 500 prophecies regarding the last days that have yet to be fulfilled. As a result, we ought to be able to identify trends in the world that would be expected in light of those prophecies. Now, we're not saying that the things we report on are definitely the fulfillment of those prophecies, just things you would expect from reading the Bible. For example, the Bible indicates that by the time the great future tribulation begins, the economies of the world will be cashless. This will allow the world leader we commonly call the Antichrist to control everybody's ability to buy and sell. There should therefore be a trend towards cashless economies, and when you check the news, there certainly is. The most recent article I read was titled, UAE, The Future is Cashless, that's the United Arab Emirates. Here's a couple of excerpts from that article. Across the world, nations are engaged in a race to move to a cashless economy. The UAE ranks foremost among regional economies most rapidly moving away from cash, says Ayad al-Kurdi, general manager of Southern Gulf and Middle East and North Africa MasterCard advisor. Then according to the 2017 World Payments Report, non-cash transactions increased by almost 11% in recent years. Countries like Sweden are paving the way to making cashless societies a reality. Only 19% of Swedish payments are now made using cash. In 2015, more than half of the Swedish population was using Swish, a mobile payment app that allows safe, free, and instant digital transactions. This trend has also been observed in Kenya, where a mobile transfer service, M-Pesa, is used by more than 30 million people for international transfers, loans, and health provision. I wonder if it'll become part of the Swiss army knife at some point. Read the Bible, and this is the kind of last day's trend you would expect. Not making any comment about it, positive or negative, but this is what you would expect to be happening, and this is what you see. As believers, our expectation is the return of Jesus Christ to resurrect the dead in Christ and to rapture living believers at that time. And so the important question for us to answer is, are you ready for the rapture? If not, get ready, stay ready, keep looking up, ready or not. Jesus is coming.